A little bit more on Dogecoin. Apparently, there's some speculation that it will also move away from proof of work towards proof of stake. This is one way to alleviate some of the energy consumption concerns. This is technology that already exists, other, other crypto, including the likes of Cardano, which I just mentioned, also Ethereum 2.0, expected to do the same, find more efficiency, save more energy, satisfy the environmental crowd, satisfy planet Earth. Uh, maybe these are what some of the conversations between Doge developers and Elon himself are focused on. And this is just speculation, by the way, from experts that this would be a significant or an important move in order to increase adoption. And then the next story as part of it here, another key, key thing that has to happen for this Doge thing to be really real has to get on Coinbase. And apparently that's happening in six to eight weeks. There was a vote that took place. Uh, People can apparently put shares towards voting for topics at Coinba Coinbase's shareholder meeting. Second most voted topic with 88.8 thousand shares put toward it was about profit and revenue growth. The first most voted topic was about adding Dogecoin. 1.5 million shares put towards it. Hmm. Everybody wants a piece of the hype. Uh, this is a business. Coinbase is a business. It's fourth in market cap. So... It's definitely a message. It's significant. It's there. It's alive. Still down on the seven day. It's been trying to bounce back. Still down on the seven day. That's Saturday Night Live. Didn't recover from that yet. Mm. Actually, Cardano is alive and well. Still working. Yeah. Still working. Kind of mapping close to Ethereum now. Like as far as the chart's concerned. Ethereum bounced back. Are we a crypto channel now? Well, it's hard not to be, man. I told you, I told you my feed. That's what happened to my feed. It, technology gets quiet for a minute and crypto gets loud for a minute. You know, I don't choose what's going on in the world. So I don't have any intent to be a crypto channel. I could just as easily be a subway channel, have Vin on every day, break it down for us. I had the rotisserie chicken. First time over here, the guy you said who's loaded up with rotisserie. Loaded. He's got a full bucket of rotisserie <laughs> sitting there. And I had it heated up. I had the rotisserie heated up yeah. as yeah. well. Yeah. And uh, as far as Subway goes, it was a great time. Yeah. As far as, good. as far as Subway goes, it was a great time. Yeah. Like, you know what Subway, they're making the sandwich in two seconds. So you got to... Uh, what? This... Oh, Show your I expectation a little bit. It does not look like that, for the record. It's a little more shredded and be like it's a little more beat up. Yeah, it looks like that. Well, go up to the. Top. I thought I saw their discontinuing rotisserie chicken. Or, this no. one? Oh, the the roast beef. Subway discontinued. Oh, and the chicken. What? Oh, uh oh, you got Vin's attention. That was June twenty second of twenty twenty. No, they didn't. They didn't discontinue it. Maybe in certain markets, we still got it. We still got it. Although Vin didn't find it at the other location. Uh, I'm running on old chicken. <laughs> chicken <That's> reserves. <laughs> you know what I put? You know what's crazy? What I did with it? Yeah. Is I put a little bit of Southwest sauce. Yeah, you could do whatever you want with it. But it totally, yeah. it totally created a unique experience. Yeah. yeah. And because it wasn't the first one you would think to put over there. Like Southwest. I mean, I don't, it wasn't the first one you would think. Which 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 one are you putting on the rotisserie? No sauce. A dry one. Yeah. Interesting. Bold. Care to explain? Mm, cheese. Yeah. Lettuce, tomato, onion, salt, pepper. Done. What? Well, which is the bread that, of choice? Italian urban cheese. Easy. Mm. Uh, it, I'm getting that on everything. That's a, that's a little bit extravagant though. No, it's good. Italian urban cheese? Mm -hmm. <sighs> a little bit luxurious, though. 